Is this thing on? Good morning, everyone. <laughs> it's my dog voice. It's so when I talk to my dog, I go, good morning. Yeah. Um, so we're currently we. I'm with Jackie, the other one. Jackie looks at me. It's currently 7.01. Imagine it was 7.05. Oh, the high one. We're at Melbourne Airport because we're in LA to meet the drone companies. What are you doing this weekend? What else do you do? It's currently Friday morning. Friday? Yeah. Guys, stop it. You should have. Oh, do you want to be in it? Whoa, what is this? Hi, guys! <laughs> Promo the store. Where are we? No, don't do that! Me. I can oh. stay We're at St. Ali Melbourne Airport International Terminal. Yay. I came here because I know this good coffee. Do all right. When did this open? Uh, about a month ago. April 22nd to April 22nd? That's unreal. Yeah. I need to so, order a coffee. Oh no, this is really bad for the camera. Um, it's free. It's on the house. I didn't do coffee. We saw it. I didn't do coffee. Well, you can have that then. Yeah. Really? Yeah, why not? Sick. That's how good the service is here. <laughs> <laughs> Well, enjoy your holiday. <laughs> Thank you. My bro, we've got some smashed avo and um, <gasps> these are nice seats. I know. Yeah. Hey, Jack. Who's ready? Look at her. She's huge. How exciting. Yuck. <laughs> no, I don't think they do. Yeah, they had a bar on the I don't think. Do they? I feel like you did sleep. Like, cause you look like you were knocked out. I honestly don't know. I got like a solid like two hours, I'm gonna say. I love all the kids that like cry. I just find it so funny because I feel so sorry. I hate it, but it was actually okay. Thanks, Jack. <laughs> we're in the car now, everyone. Um, getting driven to our hotel. And look how nice the car is, Sunrise Gable. Did for us. We've got seat warmers, some don't water. Know, I don't know what temperature that is because we do Celsius. <laughs> 67 Fahrenheit. <laughs> Love that. Charging my phone. This is so nice. We've got some Tic Tacs. We're living it up. <laughs> okay, we um, are at our hotel, guys. Where's the lighting? We just got to the hotel and it's really nice. Ah, and tell them the great news what room are we staying in? 705. And if you're yes. a Jonas fan, you know why that's such a good sign. When she said it, we were just like, what? what? I was like, did you say 705? And she, we were like, that's a good sign. She was like, it is. Is it? Yeah. <gasps> Yay! It's exactly like the bitches! <laughs> we get to make a dirty for this! <gasps> nice, nice. Oh, we can't eat any of that. This is our view. Amazing. Yeah. Oh, American flag just like over there. <laughs> America! Okay. Let's have a look. Ooh. Nice modern bathroom. Ooh! That's yeah. too close. Oh, that, That's no thanks. <sighs> okay, everyone. It's been a while. And by a while, I mean probably an hour. Let's take that out. Ugh. Yeah, we've just showered, relaxed, kind of like unpacked our bags, get all settled in, you know, hotel life. Yeah, so we're just going to walk around now, get our bearings right, because we know Rodeo Drive is like just over there. So maybe we'll go over there, get something to eat, because we're both a bit peckish now. It's like, it's 9.30 in the morning. We've got a whole day ahead of us. The thing is, we've both been here on holidays a lot, so we don't need to do like touristy things, where you just like get to like go to cool places and check them out. All the local kind of things, you know what I mean? So we can go to like cool cafes, restaurants, places that other people go ever exposed. Um, yeah, so it's like a terrible overcasty kind of day, but it's like 20 degrees, so I think I can get away with wearing a t-shirt. So that's exciting. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We want to go, okay, but first, before we go and leave the hotel, we want to check up the top of the hotel and see what the pool side's looking like up on the roof for um, Sunday, so, yeah. Yeah, cool. Uh, Rodeo Drive. Uh, <laughs> we, left. we left Rodeo Drive. We made some big purchases and now we're broke. Yeah, um, <laughs> you just can't see our bags, they're invisible. No, we gave them to our personal driver. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yes. Um, so now we're just walking to go get breakfast. 
or brunch, whatever you want to call it. I mean, technically we had breakfast on the plane, but still, like, that was before the sun was up. And that was, like, a good, like, six hours ago as well. So, mm. Anyway, so we're going to walk to Jones on 3rd to go get breakfast, brunch, whatever. All I know is I want, like, a nice coffee of some sort and a toasted sandwich. Mm. Come back home. Yeah. There are so many Teslas around. Like ah! Hot non slash lunch. Yeah, all right, all right. <laughs> Good. The streets are clean in Beverly Hills, everyone. Love that. Smile. What did I get? A fried egg break. No, a fried... A fried egg sandwich. And we have a nice latte. Delish. It doesn't look that appetizing, but it smells great. Why? Oh look, it's us. <laughs> I'm sweated everywhere. Fun times. <laughs> Put your hand there for size comparison. That's what my phone. <laughs> an iPhone 6. That's crazy. All I wanted was just one ice latte. Alright, alright. All you wanted was just a normal shake. <laughs> America. <laughs> 22 degrees, that's lovely. Um, so we just finished up having another coffee drink sort of thing on the Sunset Strip. And our waiter was from Perth. So what are the odds of that? Hello, Ryan. We gave him a little extra tip because he's just a nice, good Aussie bloke, you know? Great service. Got to help out our own. Yeah, he's trying to make it out here. <laughs> okay. Take that out again. I didn't take this camera with us because I didn't want to carry it around. But we're back from our little adventures in LA. Um, what was I going to say? I vlogged some of it on my phone, random things we did. We went to, we did a massive walk. Yeah, it was like a kilometer or two. Yeah, I'm going to say like one and a half to two kilometers um, to a cafe called Jones on the 3rd. Where are you? There you go. Um, which was really nice. Yeah. You said it reminded you of your Melbourne because it was like hips are douchebaggy. Yeah. yeah. Got a still good. It was still, yeah, it was decent. Um, so we sat there for a bit. We had like breakfast, coffee. She had a hot chocolate, yeah. Um, and then we got breakfast there, hanged out there for a bit. And then we walked to, then that was Glossier, right? Yeah. Ugh. We we thought it would be like, <laughs> see, I'm bigger? Not, I'm not much of a makeup, skincare person, but like when I saw the photos while we're at breakfast. Yeah, it looked. Um, I thought it was like huge and like. Cool, crazy. but it's not. No. It's like it's tiny. Like maybe, maybe it will be bigger than our hotel room. <laughs> Legit. Oh. It's tiny as fuck. And even like their arrangements. I can't hold this very well. <laughs> even their like the arrangements of like the products itself yeah, and shit. And you had to like look down to see what it exactly was like. Yeah. So. It just didn't like the layer didn't make sense. Yeah. And then um, they had that random little room of color. Like what, with weird sounds. What noises. was the appeal for that? I don't know. I don't know, but we fell for the hype and yeah. it did not live up to it at all, which was highly disappointing. And then we took an Uber to the Sunset Strip to another cafe that we went to check out, which was like grease kind of vibes because it was blue and white and that was fun. Nice Aussie bloke that served us. Yeah, another Aussie bloke. I mean, not another, but like another Aussie. So he was from Perth, Jackie's from Sydney and I'm from Melbourne, so it was like everywhere. Um, I had a huge ice latte, and I thought that was funny. Then Jackie wanted just a simple chocolate no, shake, just right? Chocolate, you know, chocolate milkshake. Yeah, and it was huge. It had marshmallows and like graham crackers. Graham like, crackers. It was like a small, graham pretty crackers. much like two small ones, like on was, top. And it was pretty much as big as the freaking milkshake itself. Like, it was excessive. Yeah. It was not needed. Did not finish it, obviously. No. Um, and then, oh no, I forgot to tell them the funniest bit. <laughs> oh my god, as soon as we got there, I saw this blonde guy sitting down and I was like, I know this kid. And then it clicked that if anyone watches the shittest show in the world, Riverdale, <laughs> he is Betty Cooper's fake stepbrother, fake brother, um, Chick. I think that's what I established his name was, Chick. Um, he was sitting there, catching up with a, with a friend, with a gal pal, and, um, it was so freaking funny. 
Like, such a C-grade, D-grade actor. Like, no one would know unless you watch Riverdale. I mean, like, it's a popular show, but it's fucking shit. Yeah. And you said you watched, like, one of the latest episodes and he's back in it. Yeah, I think So he's, he's still he, on I it. Think, I think it's that guy. I think he, he's the guy and he comes back with red hair and everyone's confused. Spoiler alert, Saul's guys. Saul. Um, but yeah, that's great. So that was, it was really funny. And there's so many Teslas in LA, and I was not prepared for that. I actually just read an article that did, that's playing Aladdin that just came out. He's suing Tesla. I, don't, I didn't read the whole article. Why? Like that. Like, no, you're not on Facebook. Either. Wow. Yeah. All right. And then you also read an article about iTunes shutting down. Yeah. And you also read an article that Rob Patterson is confirmed as Batman. Ah! How exciting. That's the best news ever. I'm Especially because on the plane I was watching Goblet of Fire. Oh, yeah. So I'm all like Robert Patterson, you know, obsessed at the moment. Uh, anyway, we were going to go on the hop off, hop on bus, but it was taking too long to get to like the stop we were at because we were at Whiskey Go Go and it was going to take like ages and it's hot. And we're like, sing it all, we just thought it would be nice to do it. But it's like, what time is it, Jackie? Um, It's just past two, three o'clock, sorry. We've done it. Past three. So now we can just lounge around for a few hours and then maybe go out for dinner later. Yeah. Just and just relax because. We're on a little holiday, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, it's how exciting. So yeah, we're setting up camp here for the next few hours. And then catch up to you guys when we go out for dinner or something. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay, everyone, welcome back. We had a nap. We're refreshed. Oh, it looked worse. <laughs> yeah, sleep in the eyes, maybe. Oh, God, I don't know. Um, and we're just off to dinner now. It's like 6.30. Yeah, we can have dinner and then we can go to bed. Yeah. As long as we stay up until 8, 9, hopefully. Anyway, we're going to a restaurant right across the road. Which, yeah, the hotel's like right here. And the restaurant's just like right there. It's pretty sweet. It's past 8 o'clock. Yeah, we made it past 8 o'clock, everyone. <laughs> um, and we're just walking back to the hotel after we just had our dinner. Yeah, it was great. Some pop culture conversations. Yes. As one would presume we would have. <laughs> and yes, now we can go home and go home. Go back to the hotel room and relax for the night. Yeah. Watch YouTube. Go on social media, the usual. At least everyone's awake now. Yeah. Because it's like midday back home. And look, it's 8 o'clock and it's like lit. Uh, uh, anyway, it's been a swell day, everyone. We've done lots of walking, exploring. Especially people that don't need to see things have seen it all already. Mm. So, it's not that bad. How cool. Oh my god, I'm getting fucking. What's the word when you get high sickness? So, we're just over there having dinner and Rodeo drives like right there, all those lights are. How cool. Retainers are in, so that means we're settling in for the evening, everyone. <laughs> Wee! Who's excited? Proper night's sleep. Uh.